Okay, here's my 1987 Chris Craft on a trailer. Two inch ball. I'll give you a quick walk around here. Probably be better than just pictures. The ladder there, out drive. This thing's a hydrofoil. It's supposed to help with the performance of the boat. Probably need to change the name. Um, this is the tube over here, and the cockpit cover, and the mooring cover, and the bow cover. And here's the other side of the boat, and the bimini top, tall enough for me to walk under. Let me climb in here and show you the inside. That seat I have folded down just so you can see how it can lay flat. Then to fold it up, you just grab in the middle here. Uh, flips up into a regular seat. That's the rip I was telling you about. Um, it's been that way for four years, hasn't gotten any worse. There's storage in the sides. Underneath that seat, there's a battery and a safety kit. Underneath that seat, there's the gas tank. Underneath there's the engine, obviously. This engine cover flips forward. This cover flips up. That's the ski pylon there for skiing and wakeboarding. And use the hook on the back of the boat for the tubes. And that's the driver and seat, cockpit, with gauges and switches and ignition switch. This is the control lever, forward, neutral, reverse, fire extinguisher down there. Over here there's a glove box. Inside the glove box, it's pretty deep. There's a radio down in there. I got a flashlight in here, hold on. Radio, extra plug and down here there's a ski locker there's a pair of skis in there there's a rope there's some bumpers and up front we got there's nothing underneath that front cushion, but under each cushion there's pretty deep storage bins underneath this one. Got life jackets, the boot for the bimini top. And underneath this one. More life jackets. <laughs> Uh, I think there's a, yeah, there's a, um, anchor in there. Windshield obviously folds closed. Um, the bimini tops, nice and tall and tight. These straps come down and buckle on each side. And then when you want to roll it up, you just unbuckle those straps, fold it up. And then put the boot on it. And that's about it. Hope that explains everything for you better.